Hi, Don Campbell here with Expand to Web, and I want to show you how to install and set up a really cool looking business website in less than five minutes on WordPress. So you can build a site like this. We're going to build this exact site right here uh, and do it really quickly using WordPress and the small biz theme. So let's get started. I'm going to start the timer over here, get it rolling, and you can watch and make sure I'm, I'm on schedule here. So what I'm going to do is log into Bluehost and do my install from there. Now, any hosting provider, most of them have these, um, you know, very fast WordPress installs now. Bluehost has simple scripts. I'm going to use that. It goes in, uh, asks me a few questions, and sets up WordPress for me. So I'm going to scroll down here, click on WordPress, and click the install button. Now, what happens is WordPress asks me, it asks me for a directory. Actually, simple scripts does, and I'm going to install it in the Yoga 2 directory. And then just give it a little bit of information like my yoga site admin, and then we'll set a password for it. And then we're going to click on the terms service and hit complete. Now it's going to go off and install WordPress for us and set it all up uh, in just a minute. As soon as that's done, we're going to upload the small biz WordPress theme and activate it and then make some tweaks to get that website that we're looking for. So this is what I've got so far. I've got a basic WordPress site with the default theme already set up. So let's go log in. I'm going to go here and go to admin. And using the password that we specified in that previous step, we're going to log in to the options panel for WordPress. Now, once we're into the options panel here, or into the WordPress dashboard rather, I'm going to click on appearance and we're going to go to themes. Go to the install themes tab and then click on Upload. And that's where we're going to go get the file for the Small Biz theme. This is just a zip file that you get. And you just click on the Install Now button, and it's going to upload the file for us. And then we'll just go ahead and activate the theme. And right out of the box, you're going to see that we've got a decent looking website. But we want to kind of brand it for our own business. So from here, I'm just going to do a refresh and show you what we've got by default here. Now, in the Small Biz theme, once you're in the options panel, you can go in and do all kinds of customizations now. You can go into this um, headers, choose do, do a different header. We've got a bunch of header graphics here. Um, I've got one already set that I want to use um, for this particular theme. I'm going to click that. And then I'm going to go here. And I have some colors I want to change. So I want to change the text color. I'll show you why. When I change the color of this header graphic, I want this text color to look a little different. So I'm just going to go ahead and use this lighter gray color for all of the fields that are going to show up on that header. I can turn these off as well if you've got a header graphic with its own text. But in this case, we're going to go ahead and save these changes. And then you're going to see that we've got a new look, you know, a new look to the site, a new banner, a new header graphic anyway. Now we want to put that graphic in the middle. To do that, I'm then going to go into the layout section. Now with small biz theme, you have eight different layouts to choose from. We're going to choose the Cynthia layout and save changes. Now once I've chosen this layout, I want to change some things on the home page itself. So I go to the next section here and I'm going to say choose file and upload this center banner. That's the center graphic I showed you. Then what we're going to do, let's just check our time real quick too. I want to see how we're doing on the time. We've got three minutes. Okay, we've got a hustle here. So now we've got a site. We've got a basic site. I'm going to refresh this and you're going to see with our new layout and graphics, we've got a pretty cool looking site. Now I want to change the background color. So I'm going to go here to background. This is a WordPress capability to change the background image or color to anything you want. I'm going to go to the color picker and I'm just going to change it to a nice light gray color. Actually, I'm going to do something a little bit lighter than that. Something like this. Save the changes. All right. And now I've got a nice looking background color. The only thing that's wrong at this point is this little gap here, this white gap. So I want to move that image up a little bit. That's easy to do. If I go into the WordPress editor, we provide a, um, a custom style sheet where you can make all of your changes here. And I've got a little, um, all this uh, little CSS is going to do is bump up that image by 8 pixels. All right, That is going to tweak our styles and we are good to go. So the site is essentially done at this point. We've got a complete 
website now in less than five minutes. Let's see exactly how much time it took us, four minutes. So that was it in less than five minutes. Now the thing, once we've got this set up, we can go back into the options panel and make all kinds of other changes to our business information and all that stuff. But uh, essentially we've got a pretty cool looking site very quickly. And now you, you can um, take your time going through these other things and updating the SEO, updating more about the homepage text and your business information. Now the other thing I'm gonna show you in the next video is how to then take this and in a couple of minutes, turn on a touch enabled mobile landing page for the same site and build a Facebook page for it. All right, so join me in the next video and I'll show you how to do that. Thanks for watching.